Footprints in their history stretch back 5,000 years. But for the world's greatest wall builders, makers of a forbidden city, what happens tonight is not merely a small step, but a great leap. China is welcoming the world. Who will they be when this is over? The clock of their lives has been beating with a screaming urgency. They have pushed themselves to be as sharp as a razor's edge. For this summer, to be here, now, and nowhere else. Beijing, the first ever Olympics for the world's most populous nation. 1.3 billion who framed the front page story of the 21st century. A China both outside time and bursting every which way in a bewildering rush of transformation. They have made themselves anew, relentlessly, devotedly, so they might, on these days, step into history. They've submitted to an uncompromising search for mastery. Those arms working. Repetitive motion. Technique polished toward an impossible ideal. Fall, fail, get up. It's not the triumph. But the struggle. It's not the triumph, but the struggle. but the struggle. Not the triumph, but the struggle. Why did they begin? Why do they endure? I compete because I want to run faster than any man has ever run. Flipping on a four inch beam. I like the daredevil part of it. You know, to get the chance to try to defend your gold medal, I couldn't write a better story. It is time for the colorful clash of a universe of shimmering, still to be written biographies. It is time to chase eternal youth. Time to defy public heartbreak, laws of gravity. Time for a Jamaican lightning bolt, California brilliance. It is time for the sweetly engaging gymnast from West Des Moines and the poised daughter of a decorated Olympian. It is time for the one who has endured the grinding burden of mind-blowing expectations. Time for the headliner of the Athens Games to play Superman all over. Are we about to see the fastest race ever? A dynasty confirmed? A victory cheered by a billion voices? They have pushed themselves to be as sharp as a razor's edge for the scintillating prospect of enduring accomplishment. To leave these games as the greatest Olympic champion of all time. They have made themselves anew for this summer, for Beijing, for this now.